So this is number four from the 2007 International Math Olympiad. In triangle ABC, the bisector of angle BCA intersects the circumcircle again at R, the perpendicular bisector of BC at P, and the perpendicular bisector of AC at Q. The midpoint of BC is K and the midpoint of AC is L. Prove that the triangles RPK and RQL have the same area. So first, uh, we draw on the two triangles that are uh, in the problem statement. And so the first thing to notice is that since CR is an angle bisector, then we have that alpha is equal to beta. Uh, and next, since uh, the two perpendicular bisectors meet at the circumcenter uh, of ABC, so this means that it, we can draw on the point O, uh, which is the circumcenter. So next, we see that since angle PKC is 90 degrees, then angle KPC is 90 minus beta. And similarly, we have OQP is equal to CQL, which is equal to 90 minus alpha. And since alpha is equal to beta, then um, OQP is equal to OPQ. So, uh, and this implies that OP is equal to OQ. Next, we let M be the, the foot of the perpendicular from O to CR. So since OPQ is isosceles, then M is the midpoint of PQ. And similarly, since CR is a chord of the circle and O is the center, then M is also the midpoint of CR. So this means that CQ is equal to CM minus QM, which is equal to RM minus PM, which is equal to PR. So this implies that CQ is equal to PR. And similarly, we have that CP is equal to QR. So next, um, we notice that since alpha is equal to beta, then we have two similar triangles, uh, CLQ and CKP. So that is these two triangles here. So first, notice that um, CQ to CP is equal to RP to RQ because CQ is equal to RP and CP is equal to RQ. And next, uh, by the similar triangles, we have that the height from L to CR to the height from K to CR is equal to CQ over CP, and that is equal to uh, RP over RQ. So um, uh, since CQ to CP is equal to RP to RQ. Uh, and then now we look at the areas of the original two triangles. So the area of LQR is one half times QR times the height from times the height from L to CR. And similarly, the height from uh, the area of RPK is one half of RP times the height from K to CR. So now, if we look at the ratio of the area of LQR to RPK, then the ratio would be QR over RP times RP over QR, and that just cancels out and becomes one. So this means that the ratio of the two areas is just equal to one. So they have the same area.